Hello and welcome again to another tutorial. Um, so I am going to show you guys today how to make a logo in for your series. For um, say you want to be have a uh, a Verizon Nationwide series or a Verizon Cup series, etc., etc. Um, this is how you're gonna do it. First, you need GIMP 2.0 or 2.8, whichever one it was. I forgot. I think it's 2.8. Anyway, yeah, 2.8. So you need GIMP, and um, you're going to need the logo for NASCAR Spring Cup or whatever series you're going to be doing. For right here, I have a template right here for uh, NASCAR Spring Cup. And what you want to do in order for this to work is you're going to need to posterize it. And posterize it however you like. Um, I like it at 2 because it kind of makes it like pop out, kind of, like this. Then you're going to, um, not that, you're going to go to File, Edit, or you're going to right click. And click copy. That worked. Hold on. Okay. Then you're gonna have to open Paint. Then you're gonna have to um, paste it, which is Control V. And then I want to make it uh, larger, so I'm gonna do that. Um, and then what you want to do, since you've posterized it, you can edit the um, colors now. So what I like to do is I like to white out and uh, make it large so it's easier for you to uh, cut out parts of it and just click delete on each part that you don't want so you can have a empty space for uh, for making your um, logo <laughs> I totally forgot the name so you have your clear space and I'm just gonna pick some uh, random uh, Oops, don't save it. No, I'm going to pick some random photos. You have to go back to GIMP, and you have to go to File, Open, then whichever one you want. So I'm just going to do, uh, where's my NRC? Okay, there's my NRC. You're going to have to copy that since it's made from Paint.net. Um, if you guys don't have Paint.net, that's okay. You guys can do something else with it. I don't know. I uh, don't really have much help on that. So then what you want to do is just kind of put it in here. Uh, so NRC, I'm gonna lower, I'm gonna small, shrink this a little bit, widen it. So NRC. Also, if you want to make a back of it, um, you're gonna go to Paint, right there, and then make it all kind of looks cool. And then if you want to uh, put this on black, and I'm gonna undo that, and then make it um, white text. Oh, fail, fail. So like that. So it kind of just looks like you're typed in NRC or whatever series it's in or whatever league. ARWLS, WSCT, INORL, etc, etc. So, and then what else you want to do is go back to GIMP and do another file open. And then uh, just pick um, the, uh, uh, what's it called? The um, photo you want. So say I want... Um, the AT&T logo. AT&T logo. I'm gonna I'm gonna copy one of them. Or I'm gonna save one of them. And I'm gonna put AT&T, ATAT, whatever. Um, I just so, to, typed in something pretty quick. Anyway, so then uh, it should be up here. AT&T. Then you open that and then you, uh, in order if you want to uh, change the coloring of it, Got to posterize it. See this one? You kind of want to. You might want to just keep it at three. Uh, and so you just mess around with that. Then you're gonna, like I said, copy it. Uh, I'm gonna exit out of my browser. Minus that. Minus that. Then you have your AT&T logo. And if you want to, you can uh, change the text to white if you want. You can change each layer of the AT&T, so you can make it uh, black. So you can make it black, 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 and black, sorta. But if you always want, if you want a good, um, if you want to get zoom in and get like a precise measure of it, kinda, you want to zoom in, and like that. I'm just highlighting everything that needs to be like highlighted there and if you screw up just press the undo like I just did okay um okay I think we're done with that since it's not really a 
real series I'm going to be doing. So then what you want to do is you want to, um, if you want to, you can change this. I'm going to change it to yellow, just because. So, and then to make it blend in. Why did I use black? <laughs> Why did I use black? Change it to red. Make that look pretty cool. And then, um... So yeah, that's pretty much it. And then let me zoom out. And again, and then what you want what you, you also can do is you can change this. You can change it to red, orange, any color you want. Pink. If you're one of those girls out there that do this, change it to like light orange, blue. And then um just have something that kind of fits with it. Um don't make it like pink, yellow, green and red. I mean, I don't know, just don't pick random colors all the time. So, you're gonna save your logo after I finish this. You're gonna go file and then save as, and then whatever series. So, it's gonna be NRC ATNT AT &T Cup. And then you'll click save. But I'm gonna cancel it since I don't want this right now. So that's pretty much it. You need GIMP 2.8 and Paint, which you can just find right here on your um, Start menu. You just go to Paint if you have a Windows computer. Mac, I'm not 100% sure about because I don't have a Mac. But yeah, hope this helped. Um, I also got this from NASCAR Freak 2002. So Tony, I'm just doing this just because I'm like very bored right now when I'm making this, and um, I'm not copywriting you. So, um, yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial or next race or next video or whatever. Later.